from Orlando, Florida, the number one ranked contender and former light heavyweight champion of the world, Antonio Magic Man Tyver. Tonight, we turn the page to another chapter of the saga of a boxing superstar. From Pensacola, Florida, presenting the former middleweight world champion, former super middleweight world champion, former heavyweight world champion, the reigning, defending, three-time light heavyweight champion of the world, Roy Jones Jr. All right, you guys, I gave you instructions in the dressing room. Do you have any questions? I got a question. You got any excuses tonight, Roy? Let's not ask questions like that. Let's touch gloves and go to work. Tonight, Roy. Let's go to work. That was because I was too tired. I said, tomorrow night, and up, up, up until the times that Roy would actually go to the ropes. And there were boos in the house during the first fight from time to time. That was the case on November 8th, when he seemed totally out of it those first two rounds. And trying to keep the fight right in the middle of the ring, where he has an advantage. The straight right hand won the fight for Jones in November, because at this weight, there's never been hand speed and foot speed like Roy Jones. Barber hadn't gotten off, really, and Jones is landing his right hand. It's a phony war, posing and staring and looking. It's, it's short enough to win the round, possibly, but he hasn't really been able to p penetrate or find a style yet that can penetrate through Tarver effectively. Tarver good, lands the right hand. Good right jab. And another Tarver jab, and Jones answers. Very loyal to people who work for him and to his friends. He's a good man, and he's helped a lot of boxers down there. Of course, McClellan and Jones were rivals in the amateurs the leader in the counter-puncher's war. And there's a hard left hand by Antonio Tarver. Jones tries to come back with a right to the body and a right upstairs and another right to the middle of the belly. He seems to still be giving Roy problems. Roy has not found a way still to get a sustained attack against him. And down goes Jones on a hard left hand. And that is the first that Roy Jones has ever been hurt. Only Lou Duval ever knocked him down. Jones may not get up. And he makes it up. It's and over. Jay Lady stops the fight. And Jones is still on Queer Street. And that's amazing. What a statement by Antonio Tarver. That is, that, is, that is the first time in his career he's really been hurt. He's gone down before one time, but there was a perfect left hand. Roy never saw it coming. Roy is out. And Roy in two fights now. We have to say that Tarver has bested Roy Jones. Unquestionably. The winner by knockout victory. And once again, the light heavyweight champion of the world, Antonio Magic Man Tarver. Soldiers, baby. I dedicated this to 